Hi, this is Michael's Bad Stuff, and today I've got a McFarland Toys DC Multiverse Batman, but this one is just simply uh, designed by Todd McFarlane. So uh, here's what he looks like on the front, on the front of the package. Mr. McFarlane has quite the imagination. A little accessory. He's got the batarang. He's got a couple of short swords. This would be a total Elseworlds character. Here's the side of the package. Here's the back. And here's other figures in this line. Here's the other side of the box. Todd McFarlane designed. Designed by Todd McFarlane. And I believe on the bottom it even says here, Todd Batman. <laughs> so anyway, let's go ahead and uh, take him out and see what he's like. It's kind of windy right now, so uh, probably won't be able to stand up too well on its own. But just in the event, we'll pop out that little stand they have in here. Oh, there's the uh, collector's card. Just in case you're interested. Let's go ahead and cut them out of here. Anything else holding them in? Not that I can see, okay. What in the heck? There we go. Okay, so far it's kind of cool. Ah, I guess that's where the swords go. So maybe we will, we will take out the accessories on this one. But first, let's just take a look at the Batman himself. I like the um, color blue they used on this. Of course, with the gray. Kind of digging the design here, Todd. I like the portrait. Nice, gruff looking figure there. The head movement, not so much to look up, but looking down, it's just fine. So I guess that's, you know, what he'll be doing most of the time in his detective work, trying to find stuff on the ground. Look up for clues. Anyway, I do like the bat symbol. It's nice and big across the chest there. A little bit too big, I guess, because it's it should sit right on the, as far as I'm concerned, it should sit right on the uh, outfit itself. But he has it attached to the cape. We'll take a look at that in just a minute or two. I like the abdomen twist here. That's nice. Ab crunch. Works fairly well. Goes back, goes forward. The arms. Of course, you can see the, um, they would, of course, go 360, but the cape is hindering the movement there. I don't know what all the little pouches are for on the bicep, but they look kind of cool in a tactical kind of way, like everything else. This would really hurt if he were to backhand you. Look at those gloves, oh my gosh. Anyway, these are really kind of cool. And of course, the, uh, the joints themselves, they have the bicep twist. They have the, um, the ratcheting joints, which I really appreciate because it just, they just stay in place so much easier. Nice wrist movement. And of course, that's a 
made to be holding the batarang right there. Let's take a look down here at the uh, the legs. That's as far forward as that's going to go. And that's as far back as it goes. Not that much movement on the uh, on the legs here. However, once again, they do have the ratcheting joints. You can put them in all kinds of positions here. You have the really nice foot movement. The, the McFarland toys I really like. They have a lot of articulation in some decent places here. Like with the toe flex and whatnot. It goes a little bit too much like his foot is broken, but you know, you get the idea. Now let's just take a look up here at the uh, utility belt. And it's all with the pouches, which as I've stated before, if you've seen other videos, it, that's my favorite type instead of the little capsules and whatnot. Nice logo on the belt. Throwing knives, which uh, could take place of the Batarang in an emergency. It's kind of cool. Like I said, I like the blue they use for this, and the cape is that rubbery plastic type. No pouches on the very back. But here's the same stuff on this side. The arm ratcheting with those nasty looking gauntlets. Oh my gosh. This one has uh, extra pouches on this leg over here. And then of course we'll go ahead and stand him up on his uh, little DC stand here. And he does have these holders on the back, which obviously would be for the swords. Okay, that's different, that's unique. Interesting take you have there, Todd. But then again, there's the Todd McFarlane design Batman. Hope you found this video interesting. I kind of actually dig this more now that I got it out of the package than uh, when it was in there. I think it looks kind of cool. So, um, hope you come back for more videos. Please check out others if you haven't already. Once again, I do thank you for stopping by. Thank you very, very much to all of my subscribers. Thank you very much to those of you that just decided to stop by just for a, a few minutes. Hope you all are doing well, and please take care of yourselves.